Okay, kids, over the weekend, we were doing plaster repair at Lauren's house, and we were using plaster repair washers, and I ran out of them. So today, what we're going to do is we're going to 3D print some new ones. Um, I'm going to show you how to get them from McMaster Car. You go right up here, insert, insert McMaster Car components, and it brings up McMaster Car their catalog. Let's go to washers. Um, then we're going to go, we're going to hit washers again. And we're going to come down to here. Washers for plaster. Click that. We want it to be, <clears throat> we want it to be a 3D S SAT. Let's download it. There you go. Pretty cool. So that's the washer I need. And I don't know if you guys saw that. I think it was 11 bucks for uh, 50 stainless steel ones. We're going to print 25 for 25 cents. All right, so now you know what to do. We go up here. We export it. To an STL file, we'll name it something and save it. We're in Cura. I'm going to show you something different today. Uh, I'm going to print 24 of the washers and see how we have 24 on the bed. Um, it's pretty tedious, but you can do it. So here, just come up here. I'm going to do open recent. There's the file. Here's the file here we're gonna just move it out of the way okay need to rotate it it's just like doing anything else we want it to sit flat I'm just adjusting it on the bed where I want it another thing I did do was I wanted these to be five millimeter total so change this to five millimeter and there you go so that's how you arrange more than one print. Let's slice it. So it'll take two hours and 21 minutes, 21 grams of material, 7.88 meters long, and it'll be 47 cents. Looks good. Off to the printer. Click the link in the description to see how I repaired the plaster using these 3D printed washers.